The Sikorsky JRS Flying Boat Amphibian from World War II. The JRS-1 is on display here to, end, to show the public what an artifact in storage at the Air and Space Museum looks like. And so you can see that it's withstood years of being outside, the uh, fabric is cracked, the paint's peeling, it's faded, and it really gives the visitor an idea of what these artifacts you know, endured over the years before kind of put, being put into a stable environment. And then here in the restoration hangar is even better so people can see that. It was fully assembled at our Garber facility and then it had to be taken completely apart, so that entire one-piece wing above the fuselage. The boat hull itself is all one piece, so it's a major undertaking in, in regards to that. Take the engines apart, the propellers apart, and then put on trucks, and then moved to the restoration hangar here, and fully assembled you know, with cranes, a lot of very diligent, delicate work, uh, and that's what our folks here do very well. And then put on display so the public can see it here in the restoration hangar. And so we have curator, we have our restoration and preservation team, uh, and then we have our conservators. And so we get together, we look at this and go, okay, what, what needs to be done? Uh, and so this is pretty far gone in regards to you could preserve it, but what are you preserving? And so uh, this is probably a, a very strong candidate for restoration. And so what that would be is that you would return the appearance and even somewhat part of the functionality of this airplane to a specific date. And this one would probably be the December 7th moment. And so uh, recovering all the fabric, repainting the metal, recreating all the markings, uh, repairing, you know, replacing the, the plex and the glass and the windows, making sure that it's as, as equipped as it was on that specific date. And so, um, so this is a, a, a hard case because in the world of museums and how we look at things, we, the, the trend right now is preservation. Uh, this airplane has received so much damage from the sun, from being outside, that there's no way you can really preserve it to a, uh, when it stopped flying. That there's so many repairs that need, need to be made. I mean, you see the split fabric in there on the wings especially. And so you have to make sure that you you know, what do we want to do with it? So what's the goal? And so I think we're leaning towards restoring this to that December 7th.